What's up people, Twilight Masquerade is here and today we're going to be opening this Pokemon Center ETB. Let's get it cracked. Of course, most of us know what's in an ETB by now, but anyway, oh, we'll have a look at the promo. Stamped, non-stamped. I don't mind it. It's not my favorite. Code. Sleeves are pretty cool. Hopefully they're like clear ones. Energies, dividers, damage counters. Let's build this off. Launch that. Lay these out. Ooh. So, for me, it's Eevee, Chansey, Pinsa, and of course, Greninja. A few others from my collection, but those in particular. Whew. Right, so uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven packs. Let's get to it. And the first pack Well You heard it, you heard me say it. I can't say any more than that. That's and it looks in good nick. That's good condition. That's a nice card. Oh god. Let me focus the center in there. Don't know if you can see that. It looks slightly off left to right though. But nice card. More than happy with that. <clears throat> Great start to the box. Let's get it sleeved. Chase card from pack one. Can't really be arguing with that, can I? Okay. Pack two. Imagine if we got all the check. I don't even think I don't even know if it's possible, but I suppose it is. Imagine if we got all the cards I just named at the start of the video. That'd be unreal. <laughs> An amorous double there, but no hit. So, I mean, I don't know what I think about them little ogre mask cards. I don't know. There's a lot of hate on them before we've even seen I haven't even seen them in hand. So, it looks like we've got one of those um, Ace Spec cards here. Nice. Take that. That is Legacy Energy. That don't mean nothing to me. I suppose it means more to those who play the game. And now the time to open these sleeves to see if they are... Clear. Are they clear? They're not. They've gone back to frosted sleeves. I'm irritated now. That's it. Oh, well. <clears throat> All right. Third pack. Fourth pack. Oh, no. What have we got? No hitting that one. I mean, what do you people think of the, you know, the, the the ogre things? Like you say, a lot of people compare them to the Crash Bandicoot mask. That'd be one hell of a crossover, and I'd be a fan of that. To be fair, that'd be a chase card of mine if it was the uh, the mask from that. <clears throat> I do have the tins. I will be opening them as well. Okay. Hmm. Cornerstone mask. So I don't like the way that looks, if I'm honest. Just, just like, I don't know. It looks like there's nothing there, just pattern across the whole screen. Hold on, I can't get these sleeves out, they're stuck. Let's get a few of these out. There you go. Wow. Right. Three hits. Still another five packs left. Zapdos Hollow. Nice card, but not what I'd consider a hit. How can it be? Hmm. 
Nothing. Last three packs. Wouldn't mind a couple more hits, but I mean, three hits from 11. Mm. Nothing there. Last two. The Greninja's obviously well up there, but I'd certainly take the Eevee or the uh, Chansey. Or a hit at this point would be appreciated. Ooh. Don't think there's anything there to finish on. Nope. Let's take a look at what we did get. So, I don't like that card at all, but it is a hit. Legacy Energy. And, well, that's a hit, so I can't complain too much. Catch you soon.